In problem two, uh, in problem twenty-four of section four point one. Uh, we're looking at something called the homogeneous linear differential equation with constant coefficients, which essentially means just an equation of this form here. We have constant coefficients and uh, we have um, nth derivative plus coefficient times n minus 1 derivative and so on, all equal to 0. Now, we want to show that um, if y1 and y2 are two different solutions to this equation, then their sum is also a solution. So what we're going to do is we're going to assume, well, okay, y1 and y2 are solutions. Now let's plug in y1 plus y2. So here we'll have a n times y1 plus y2. And we'll take the nth derivative of that plus a n minus 1 times y1 plus y2. Uh, and take the n minus 1 derivative, n plus dot 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 all the way up to a1, y1 plus y2 prime plus a naught, y1 plus y2. And now since the derivative is linear, meaning that the derivative of the sum is equal to the sum of the derivatives, we can rewrite this as a n times the nth derivative of y1 plus a n times the nth derivative of y2. And similarly, we can split up each term here. Instead of writing all that out, I'm going to add another step here and rearrange all the terms together um, so that all the y1s are together and all the y2s are together. So, here we have a n y1, uh, the nth derivative of y1. And over here we'll have plus a n minus 1 times the nth derivative, of, or n minus 1 derivative of y1. And all the way down to a1 y1 prime plus a naught y1. And similarly, we'll have the same equation, just replacing uh, y1 with y2. Well, we assume that both uh, y1 and y2 were solutions. So that means that this whole thing here is 0, as well as the first n terms. So we just have 0 plus 0 equals 0. So we see that substituting in y1 plus y2 for into this differential equation um, does satisfy it, meaning that the right hand side or both sides do equal zero. But now part B asks us to prove kind of a similar thing. Um, only this time we want to find out whether uh, we want to find out that if y is a solution, then is C y also a solution where C is any constant? So you know we'll just substitute in so we have a n times cy, uh, take the nth derivative, and all the way down to a1 cy prime plus a naught cy. Now, since the derivative is linear, we can just pull out coefficient, or pull out um, constants. So this is going to be a n c, or write it, c times a n times the nth derivative of y plus all the way down to uh, c a y prime plus c a naught y. 
uh, we see that we have a um, C in each term. So we can factor that out, which just leaves us with our original differential equation. But we know that y is a solution. So this part is equal to 0. We have c times 0 is equal to 0. So we see that cy is also a solution of this homogeneous linear differential equation.